Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So following the major catastrophe involving CrowdStrike software in July, that um, caused an outage on millions of PCs, Windows PCs and servers worldwide, it seems now that Microsoft is going to take steps to increase the security and overall resilience of the Windows operating system. And that's because Microsoft recently hosted the Windows Endpoint Security Ecosystem Summit, which brought together um, security vendors and government officials to discuss ways to improve the overall security landscape. So obviously they, this was discussed to kind of prevent another catastrophe like CrowdStrike happening. And there's quite a lot going on in this post. So what I'll do is I'll leave this uh, linked down below in the description if you'd like some more in-depth info. But just to kind of skim over the meat of this, uh, because I thought this did warrant a video because obviously CrowdStrike was a major issue which we did talk about on the channel. Now basically, one of the key takeaways from uh, the summit was the shared responsibility to improve transparency and resiliency around product functionality, updates and disruption management. And then short-term solutions were also discussed at the summit which included the development of uh, shared best practices for safe deployment practices, increased testing of critical components, improved compatibility testing, better information sharing, and tighter incident response coordination. Now, something else, Microsoft also outlined plans for longer-term improvements to Windows, which I thought and I think is a key takeaway um, from the summit. So they discussed adding more security improvements to Windows 11 outside of the kernel mode, and they also discussed other related topics, including, and I thought these warranted just to have a quick look at. So some of the areas discussed also included performance needs and challenges outside of kernel mode, anti-tampering protection for security products, security sensor requirements, development and collaboration principles between Microsoft and the ecosystem, and secure by design goals for future Platform. So those are some of the other related topics that were discussed. Now, um, over and above that, um, in addition to those key topics being addressed, Microsoft also addressed the importance of customer actions for improving resiliency, such as implementing business continuity planning, major incident response plans and regular data backups and it kind of makes me think why this wasn't all put in place in the f in the in the first regard so better late than never i suppose but nonetheless um and this obviously is all to prevent another situation like the crowd strike um catastrophe and um, but of course it remains to be seen if these plan changes discussed at this at the summit will be enough to do that but as mentioned that um summit blog post will be linked down below if you'd like some more info and just wanted to put this out there because obviously we did talk about CrowdStrike quite a lot on the channel and it did gain quite a lot of interest so thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one